Hey there you guys, Moonlight Butterfly Miku back again. And well, earlier I was um well, I seem to find most of these um pictures on my Facebook page. I was scrolling down, one of my friends shared it, and it did make me think a lot about something. It's in regards to Pokemon and its popularity today. So the picture that I found here says, as you can see it, I'll read it. It says, trend followers in a nutshell. When Pokemon Go came out, oh my god, Pokemon! I love Pokemon! Oh yeah, I caught Pikachu! Blah, 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 blah. And everybody jumped on it, which was true. When Pokemon Go first came out, it was a big deal. Like most things. When it first come out, ooh, everybody gotta do it. Everybody's just jumping on the bandwagon, as usual. However, with the second picture, as you can see, where Pokemon Sun and Moon came out, and Pokemon Sun and Moon is a whole new adventure with whole new Pokemon, but even so, that doesn't have nothing to do with it. The main games in general, the, the same people that play Pokemon Go, what's that? I don't even have a DS, I don't play this. I know, I stopped playing that a long time ago. B -b -b okay. You stop playing the main games. Okay, let's see. All right, let me see if I can reiterate because this, this shit is frustrating because it did really bug me in the beginning as well. How, oh, you just want to jump on the bandwagon because it's popular, but this is the same people that used to talk down about Pokemon that didn't like Pokemon or stop watching it or stop playing it when they since they were kids, blah, 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 every excuse in the book, but then this comes out and now all of a sudden you just jump in on it because everything, because everyone else is. I don't like... Um, what's the word? People, well, bandwagoners or trend followers. As soon as something comes out, ooh, everybody's doing it, so yeah, I gotta do it too. No, it's called being original. If you know good and well that you don't like, you know, like let's say Pokemon Go, if you're not a fan of Pokemon, that's fine. I respect that. That's cool. I'm a huge fan of it, but I don't judge anyone else because they're not. But the fact that, oh, it's something, ooh, everybody's doing this, so I got to do it. I mean, people were going nuts over it. I mean, like me, I did download it for like, what, a day? I went out and did it. I said, what's the excitement in this shit? I was really like, I didn't find it fun or engaging or anything like that. Maybe it's just me, but I, I prefer the main games on the DS. The main games where you can go and get the badges or whatever, or in the Pokemon Sun and Moon, these trials. It has a story. With Pokemon Go, all you're doing is walking around the neighborhood and looking for freaking... It just didn't click with me. So I guess that's why I uninstalled it early. I uninstalled it within that same day that I installed it. I uninstalled it. Why? Because I didn't like it. But the fact of the matter is, I don't like people who just jump on the bandwagon because something is popular. And then those are the same people that talk down on the shit. You know, the same people that will look at us when we cosplay or if we say we like anime and things like that and say, oh, that's weird. You need to grow up, blah, blah, blah. And then you go around just because this come out now, you want to be part of it too? No, sit the fuck down. I'm sorry. You got to sit down for that. You may disagree with me and that's fine, but this is the way I feel. This is my opinion on this matter because it really did bug me. Like, even, I'll give you an example, when the game was, when it first came out and it was really, really popular, I remember that I did. I put up a status saying, oh, so all of a sudden, apparently, we have all these fans of Pokemon since Pokemon Go came out, so let's do a little test. Name 30 Pokemon, excluding Pikachu. Yeah, I did it. I took it there. I don't care, because the shit bugged me. It pissed me off, because I'm like, oh, now where the fuck is all these people coming from out of the Woolworths talking about you like Pokemon? You know damn well you don't. You just wanted to do it because every fucking buddy else is doing it. If everyone jumped off the Brooklyn fucking bridge for fun, you probably do it too. Not saying you in particular, I'm talking about in general, because people like to follow what's popular, what's new, what's this and that. I mean, there's no point in checking it out, but it's just like, you know, I never really was a... You know, one of the people that like, oh, this new thing came out, so I got to do it. Honestly, it took me a very, very long time. Like, even with social media, like, I refused to get Facebook in the beginning, but because of all my friends and everything, and I figured, hey, keep in contact with them, you know, stuff like that. Even Instagram took me a long time to get, but hey, what can you say? It's just, I don't understand it. Like, even now, Pokemon Go, you notice 
Pokemon Go's popularity has went downhill. I mean, I mean, people still play it now that they have these um, what do you call it, raid battles or whatever it is. Even like I said, I've been uninstall uninstalled the app, so I don't know about any of you know the new updates or whatever. But it's just uh, I don't know. It's I just like I said, I don't like followers. I never have. I've always been an individual, meaning I just kind of stray away from the things that people think are, you know, the norm or something popular. I usually be away from that kind of stuff because I'm like, hey, that's not. And I and then I will check it out for myself. I'll give. I, I always give things one chance. If I like it, then I like it. If I don't, then I don't. Plain and simple. But with the whole Pokemon Go thing, it's just really, ugh. I just, ugh. they really, really, really aggravated me when the game first came out because it was like on the news and everything. And I'm like, wow, Pokemon hasn't been this popular since the 90s. And I'm just like, where, how? I mean, like, I understand, yeah, there's some people that maybe like fell, I mean, they were Pokemon fans. And they kind of fell off because they can't keep up with all oh, the new Pokemon. That's understandable because, yeah, it, there are a lot. And it's kind of more than what the Gym 1 is, what they call them, that are used to only 150. Now it's like 700 plus, maybe 800 with the new releases of Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon. You never know. But it's just, you know, it's just like people came out. What works with this shit? It was, it was just like, you like... No, it's, it's just, you know, so that, that picture, it really did, you know, I agree with the picture because it's just like, you'll play Pokemon Go, but then again, you, you would never even pick up one of the main games and play that, but you'll play Pokemon Go. And you claim to like Pokemon, but you're only playing Pokemon Go. You're not even playing the main game. So how can you really call yourself a fan if you're not really engaging in all that Pokemon has to offer? I mean, there's way more. Like I said, Pokemon been out since the 90s. Hello, the 90s. It had its popularity peak back then and it's still going strong today. But it's just like, oh, people just like kind of tapered off and, you know, I, I don't know. It's, it's a confusing state, but hey. I'm not going to spend too much time talking about this. I was just stating my opinion about the whole Pokemon Go thing. Me personally, I don't like it. It caused a lot of problems, um, specifically in people getting hurt, walking out in the middle of the street, leaving their cars, going into abandoned alleys to catch a fucking Snorlax or some bullshit. I'm just like, okay, this is, this is taking it too damn far. It's taking something that I really love and you're taking it and turning it into a whole fucking thing that doesn't even need to, you know, it's just turned into a whole clusterfuck of crap, you know? But hey, anyway, that's just my opinion. I didn't want to spend too much time talking about this, but this is my opinion. Thanks for hearing me out. You don't need to agree with me. If you don't, please let me know why in the comments below. I like to, you know, engage in a conversation about what do you think about Pokemon Go? Do you love it? Do you hate it? Do you feel the way I do about people following the trend just because it's popular? Or do, are you genuinely a Pokemon fan from 90s on? Or did you taper off during the middle? Let me know. Let's engage in a conversation here, guys. But anyway, thanks for watching. I hope to do more little discussions like this every now and again. If I find something that really speaks to me or that I find annoying or whatever, I'll be sure to discuss it here. All right, so I'm going to get going now. Until next time, this is Moonlight Butterfly Miku saying bye, guys.